Welcome to the ITU studio at the World's Telecommunication Development Conference here in Kigali, Rwanda, where I got the great honor of being joined in the studio today by the Honorable Toilupe Pomudunuku Odisemu, who is the Minister for Communications and Information Technology for Samoa. Minister, welcome to the studio. Thank you very much, uh, Your Excellency Max. Thanks for the opportunity to be interviewed here in this um, session, in this event, the WTDC 22 Kigali. And I'm very fortunate, very fortunate as a Pacific Island, represented here uh, you know, for small island states, Samoa. So we're, thanks for, for, for inviting. Yeah. Now, I know that it's uh, quite an arduous and lengthy journey to get here from Samoa, so I wanted to ask you, why is uh, WTDC important? Why did you, did you take the time to, to be here today? Well, it, it, Max, to be honest, it's uh, uh, our new government just um, came into power last year, um, in the middle of last year. So this is a, a good introduction, good learning curve. Let's start, um, you know, uh, learning where, where the industry are, and where we're heading, you know, what, what's the future lies for us, and where can we put our priorities as a, as a nation, as a, as a country. So coming all the way here, we have a, a delegation of uh, six members. Uh, one attended la last week at the youth, um, session, you, you know, which, which is a good learning curve for everyone. And what are the, some of the key outcomes that you hope will come from WTDC here? Um, for the, the, there's a lot. I'm trying to work out when, in which sequence I, where, where I start. But last week we, we were at the WISIS, uh, at which, you know, preparation for coming here to w, WTDC. Um, one of one of the key things that we we um, uh, that it's a, it's a global community. Everyone, you know, even this industry, because I was at the, the transport industry. Now coming to the uh, you know communication and IT industry, we're all working together towards a common goal. Uh, no one is left behind. Everyone to be connected uh, and so forth, and to have a. Um, you know, every even the islands, uh, you know, development, uh, growth, economy, so, so everyone will enjoy life. So I guess uh, it's one of the things that we, we're, we're here, we're, we're um, happy to be involved in, uh, in, in the planning of what's to come in, in, in industry. So also got a chance to, uh, we were at the launching of the Partner to Connect, which is obviously um, a, 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 um, a good platform for growth, but also to share ideas. We learn from the experts of the industries and so forth. So it, uh, it, it, um, it's a good investment. Our government has put forth to send a, a delegation here, but also it's good for me personally in terms of learning. Um, Absolutely. And, and, and just I was going to say, what, what, what are the next steps? What's the, what's the future look like for Samoa in terms of telecommunications? Well, uh, from Samoa's pers perspective, uh, uh, best example is um, like at home at the moment, where we're, we're considering all options. What I um, it consider what we what that means is uh, no no ideas is is, is a wrong ideas. You know, before when the, the, the cables and the fibers enter the, the the arena of telecommunication, everyone thought it's a, it's the way to go. But the the experience from Tonga and even in our neighboring island, American Samoa, which the cable was cut, the, you know, the disaster hits, you know, we all went back to satellites. So right now in Samoa, we're reinstalling the satellites as a redundancy plan for our fiber cables. Uh, so as, a, as Samoa, we, we, we're considering all opportunities, uh, technology in the infrastructure, make sure we have a proper infrastructure to, that will leverage and facilitate economy growth, but also we're looking at uh, improvement in terms of capacity building, right from the school level up to the experts of the, the industry. So having a, a, a proper and a good infrastructure um, to, to assist in our economy, but also having the exp expertise, the, you know, giving capacity building uh, trainings and so forth, part of the full partnership, but also having the right technology that will facilitate uh, and, and, and uh, take us through to, to reach our goals. So Samoa will, will commit, uh, not only from the uh, policy side, but also from the operational side of things, yes. Well, Minister Pumanuduku on December, thank you so much indeed for joining us here in the studio and I hope uh, we'll catch up with you again very soon, perhaps uh, in Samoa. Thank you, Max. <laughs> okay, yeah. thanks very much indeed. All right.